Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to change your Adobe Elements software for Premiere and Photoshop so that it doesn't open the splash screen when you open up the icon. So let's say you have a Premiere uh, Elements and Photoshop Elements icon and you click on either one of them. It'll open up the splash screen then you have to click on, you know, Photo Editor, Video Editor to open up the uh, actual program from there. And then you got to close this to get out of the way. So if you right click on either one of them and you go to the Properties, you can see that it's set to run in Program Files, Adobe, Photoshop Elements 2023 EXE, and this one here. Premiere Elements 2023 EXE. And that's what starts up the splash screen. So what you want to do is open up File Explorer and navigate to Program Files, Adobe, and then you'll see you have a folder for uh, Premiere Elements and Photoshop Elements. And this is for the Pro version, so disregard that. Then you also have the organizer as well, if you want to change that or add a shortcut for that. So let's say for Photoshop, we're going to go into the Photoshop Elements folder. And then you can see we want this Photoshop Elements Editor EXE. That's what will run the actual program. So what you want to do is copy the path up in here. So let's go to the, here's the Elements. Let's just do a Control A to copy, Control V to paste. Then we have to put a backslash and then go back here. And we could, rather than uh, type it, we could copy the uh, file name here. And put it at the end, paste it in there. So now we have the path of Program Files, Adobe, Photoshop Elements 2023. You know, obviously it might be a different number in your case. And then Photoshop Elements Editor, EXE. Let's apply that. Click OK. So now if we open our Photoshop Elements icon right here, takes us right into the app. And then for this one here, we'll go back out. We'll look at the Premiere Elements folder here. Copy the path. Paste it in there, backslash. And then we need to find the executable. Right there. And if you don't see the .exe, that means you don't have file extensions shown, uh, which you could do. I'll show you that in a second, actually. Let me just paste this in here. And then apply that. Okay. And now when we open up Premiere Elements, it goes right to the program. Okay, so for file paths, uh, depending on which version of Windows, Go to the View menu, then you want to go to Options. Uh, in Windows 11, I think there's, there's a drop-down where you could check um, Show File Extensions. But what I like to do is go to the Options, which you could get to in Windows 11 as well. View, and then uncheck the box for Hide Extensions for Known File Types, and then Apply to All Folders. And that'll do it to all your folders, and then Yes to that. All right, so once again, just you know, check the properties. Make sure you go to the... Uh, uh, right folder here, either Elements, uh, Premiere Elements or Photoshop Elements, find that executable for each one. Copy the path here, add the executable at the end, you know, backslash at the end. And then you'll have your icons pointing to the right place. And then, like I said, too, you can go to the Organizer and then find the Organizer element or Organizer executable as well and make a shortcut for that. All right, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.